Welcome back YouTube, Jason here, Jam Chicagoland Cichlids, Fish Room Showroom located here in Morris, Illinois. Today's date is August 25th, 2015. Uh, I believe it's been since June 27th since our last video, we do apologize. Been on vacation uh, throughout the summer. It's a slow time of the aquarium business anyways. You'll start seeing more videos coming up through the uh, fall and winter here. Currently we're sitting at 741 subscribers. Thank you. Thanks everyone who clicked that subscribe button. We're still shooting for a thousand subscribers by the uh, end of 2015. And we might even do a giveaway for a thousand subscribers. We haven't done a giveaway yet, but I believe uh, that's our big milestone. So we'll, we'll be doing something there. Stay tuned for that. Not a lot of new things going on here in the fish room. A couple little modifications. Uh, our biggest thing is our fish. Finally starting to grow. Got some nice four inch males. Check out that OB peacock. It's our OB peacock uh, grow out tank and our hybrid uh, peacocks. Pretty nice looking males there. So on our table here, we got seven five and a halfs. This uh, will be gone, we'll be building a new rack, which will be the last rack in this room because there's absolutely no more room to put anything. We'll have uh, 255s on the bottom, back to back, and on the top we'll have, I believe, five of these five and a halfs. Have to see what we're gonna be able to fit up there. And then we just gotta leave a little room for our food and little spot to strip our fish and then on the very top will be 420 longs so that's our future expansion that'll be about it for tanks in this room uh, never have committed to building out in another room this uh this is more than we can handle or we can handle it it's more than i want to handle if we move out in another room so we're not the biggest guys out there but as you can see, our fish room, fish room showroom here, and uh, it's kept up very well. We take uh, very good care of our fish, and we'll keep on providing quality fish for our customers out there. All right. I wish I had about 100 of these guys, because that sell like hotcakes. Albino Africobu. That's a nice male right there. We're just growing these guys out and get them breeding here hopefully in the next couple months. This is also our grow out tank for our yellow blaze. Couple nice males right here. Alright. I'll show you the top tanks from the back side. Let's see a little bit better into them. 125. Nice dragon blood right there. Ruby red. Another dragon blood or big rotisai over here. Nice big stud yellow blaze. Let's scroll down. Our substrate, our local uh, pet store quit carrying our substrate. You see we ran out, we only got about half that covered. Need to get this thing going for growing out some uh, of our peacocks. This is one of my favorite little tanks. 40 breeder down here, we're growing out cobalt blue zebras, chipokes, red top aristochromis, and OB zebras. Pretty neat. This uh, nice looking tank with all the different color in there. And while we're here, this is probably our, one of our newest uh, updates for the fish room. Used to put the uh, spoon in here to feed the fish underneath the uh, 
ribbed uh, DIY lid. Cut out a little square in each of our lids. Might be two and a half inches by one inch or three inch by one and a half, whatever it is. Let's cut this little piece out. Got a nice little slider. Feed the fish, cover it back up. Real nice, we got that on all our uh, DIY lids like this. All right, let's take a squirrel around. Got our dehumidifier off because it's too noisy. Little Demason Eye Africa Blue Grow Out. Bunch of little uh, frying there. Pundamilla Nair Eye Grow Out. Got a bunch of guys in there. SRTs. Got a ton of these guys. Little Grow Out Tank. Breeder box right here, we have our first uh, batch of Red Top Luanda Fry that we bred. Pretty excited about that. Red Shoulder Peacock Breeding Group. Mr. Sexy right there. It's our breeder male. Got a couple holy females in there. I got a strip. Breeder box here. Bunch more SRT. Think it's hanging on is our Angara Flametail breeding group. Get a look at our male back there. There he is. Hollow Reef and Bunas. We've had one successful batch of fry. Uh, half of them, we lost half of them, but we got fry or five little fry. I'll show them to you in a the breeder box here shortly. OB Peacock Breeding Group. Let's roll over here. Nice little tank of uh, OB Peacocks growing out. Got a bunch of fluorescents in this tank. We need to move them over to 20. Starting to get some decent size on them. Fluorescent Breeding Group. Dominant male or subdominant right there. Some of our DIY egg tumblers, a couple of them in action right there. Hey, Mr. Chipoke's out. We got a very nice uh, group of Chipoke's here. That is the male, and there's the three females. That female is holding right there. Very nice and bonus. Bicolor 500s. Had this group about three months, still no breeding action, kind of getting uh, discouraged, waiting. Need to come up with some kind of liquid Viagra to throw on the tank. Get some action going there. Red Top Wanda breeding group. They say we had one batch of fry, I showed them to you over in a breeder box. That's their subdominant male right there. Our dominant male is hiding in the back there. You guys are still. Uh, Still young, we have had one uh, successful batch of fry. Another one of our DIY egg tumblers in action. All right, albino Eureka Red, Eureka Red Grow Out. Nice little albino there. One of our most active groups, our red shoulders. There's a little batch of fry. A bunch of them in there. Lemon Jakes. These are F1. Uh, we bought them to grow them out. We do have a breeding group of uh, Lemon Jakes we've started. Still young though. We got our Flame Tails. And some more SRTs. Breeder box here is full of Split Gene Eureka Reds. You can see the albinos in there. That's our second most uh, active breeding group. Here's some F1 Red Top Luandas. Growing them out. We got a glimpse of our uh, dominant male in the tank there. Very nice fish. For the size, he's got beautiful color. Got a couple males in there. 
on the middle of Nair eye. Got three, four males in there. Got some big OB zebras in here. Here is our Eureka Red group. These guys are split gene. Got a whole new female there. Are hanging in the midair, five and a half. It's magic, folks. That's what's holding them up. Top tank, we got some Eureka Red in here. OB Peacocks. Chipokes. And some long gas chuary in the bottom down here. Scroll over while we're down here. It's our tank of grow out tank of the Mason I slash breeding group. Let's keep them all in here and uh, strip the females when they're holding. I think we got a holding over here. SRT red shoulder peacock grow out tank. There's a nice red shoulder there. Nice male SRT there. We got like three, four males showing color far as the red shoulders in this tank. SRT breeding group. It's one of our breeder males back there. These guys are slow to get going, but once they got going, man, we're like overrun with SRT fry. We got flavescence in this uh, breeder box here. And then this tank here, check out that guy right there. That is one nice ruby red male that albino is in there too there's a nice male albino we will be breeding these guys uh, i'm gonna move them over to 30 long here shortly and sell off a couple of males and keep us a couple of each let's keep them mixed albinos and the regular strand and they are split gene anyways little tank up here longatus chelosi grow out our Longatus Chelosi breeding group. One of our females, our males always hiding back there. Africa Boo breeding group. There's our male there. Let's come on and say hi, of course not. Camera shy. Okay, so I'll so, uh, show you these tanks from up here. I think you get a better view. Uh, it's another Longatus Chelosi grow out tank. We've got some nice young males in here, three or four of them. Show them color. Eureka Red grow out. It's got there's like three males right here. Nice size. Africa Blue grow out tank. We've got a couple males in there. And another tank of red shoulders. Longatus Chuary. That's our breeder male. Of course, he's going to hide in the dark there. Yeah, I get a picture of yeah. Well, I got a We've got some dragon bloods in here. Some nice young males. I'm actually starting to show some color. Being that small of a size. And these are some more hybrid peacocks. Pretty unique, unique looking males there. Lemon Jakes. This is our breeding group. Of course, our male is going to hide right now. This little young group, gonna grow them out and breed these guys. These are F1. So we got Kenya in here, Cobalt Blues, and our Hollow Reefs are in here, our five Hollow Reefs in this breeder box. This is our failed attempt at breeding bristle moles. I just moved all the bristle moles we had left into different tanks for algae control. We need Gural tanks, so we'll probably be moving the uh, fluorescence down in this tank. 55 long here, waiting to get substrate. 